Hey everyone, it's CCS. Welcome back to another episode of Amnesia: The Dark Descent. Okay, we find another note. Third of July. Oh my God. 1839. Today I picked up Herbert's things at the customs house. I dug through the trove of documents he had carried and found a log detailing the expedition. The nature of this text ranged from quick notes to colorful accounts of transpired events. I skimmed the pages, trying to figure out what might have happened. May 17th, the day I was trapped inside the orb chamber, Herbert dryly states, Orb chamber? Trapped? After one hour of entrapment. Ah, it no, he lost his memories. I was suffocating within minutes. How could I have lasted an hour? I continued reading the peculiar Ow. text. Herbert states his facts without judgment or passion. But suddenly, I could read frustration into his text. He pushed his men to investigate the underground tomb, an effort which seems to have strained the minds of his men. Madness spread through the ranks, and Herbert had to take some extreme measures to continue. He finally visits the chamber himself, where he retrieves the orb to the surface. His account confuses me greatly. If he has the orb, what are those pieces in my drawing room? Oh boy. That is some crazy shite, man. Oh, God. No, no. Let's not do this again. I just started the episode! I should have shut that door. Apparently a grunt can open doors. That was quick and efficient. Or whatever. Bunny! 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 Now where'd it go? <clears throat> For a second I thought that was... Yeah, for a second I thought that was... Yeah. 4th of July, 1839. That wasn't it's there done. before. The orb is assembled. I was awakened by... Hey, happy right America there. Day. Shaking and sweating, I retired to the drawing room with a cup of tea. The relic pieces lay spread across the table as I'd left them. But somehow, I knew how it was supposed to be. I fetched the tar, which I had prepared to fix the pieces together, and without fault, I joined them, producing the orb I remembered so clearly. The tar proved unnecessary. It was pushed out from the joining pieces as they merged on their own, with no adhesive. The ancient stone relic now rests on my table. Its immaculate surface and perfect shape could have been molded by a factory. This is all. Too strange. This kind of reminded me of Treasure Planet. I gotta rewatch that film someday. It's freaking good. It doesn't deserve a sequel, but it did have some amazing vocal music. I really like the. Like, if you remember the film, I rem I think the the both of us can agree that Jimbo. That's what I like to calling him because uh, you know who did it. Oh, thank God, there it is. I guess it is a good place to hide it then. What? Oh, a key. Okay. So, I've never seen this in a custom store before. There we go. Never seen it before. Machine room key. And that is where the custom stories start. As soon as you put a key, as soon as you put a key in the game, it'll just automatically tell you that you've got a machine room key. I'm not going to lie. If you don't mess around with it, you're just going to get that showing up. It's really in almost every custom story that doesn't pay attention to that. Oh. And about Jim... Ah, uh, frick. And about Jim... Eh, Jim Hawkins. These are based off Treasure Island. I forgot that uh, it literally just stops me from... Uh, so It literally just skips over what I, uh, what I say most of the time. To hope you realize. So, 
Maybe this will help. Don't forget your bag, Daniel. I won't, Herbert. There is no shame in using a parasol in the desert. As it happens, it's imperative to your survival. But it looks ridiculous. The shame will hurt much less than dying, I assure you. Okay, so that thing I was talking about with uh, Hawking's. Well, I was I was thinking because it remind the H stone reminds me of that orb from the from the movie. And you know what? I kind of find it okay. So I know, Mike. Both you and I, who have seen the movie, probably like the relationship that uh, Jim and uh, Long John Silver had. Hawking and Silver had a, a really great relationship. And I like them both. I really do. Even though, uh... Like, Little Squid and what... You know what? The best character in the film is pretty much Ben. Yeah, you remember Ben? Oh my god, he's freaking amazing. And whoever voiced him? Yeah. Does it work? It's not working. Well, I know that. Machine room. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, god. Tap your fans with a quick post about your upcoming video. Something is coming tomorrow. Scheduled for tomorrow. Try to guess what it is my god yeah boy okay let's get back to the freaking episode for a second I thought I stopped my stopwatch but I know it's locked okay He panted heavily. Find. Not good music, not good music, even though the music in here is really good. That fragrance. The mask was rose. I don't know how long this is. 1839. Haunted. Today I went to the university looking for answers. I was able to sneak into Herbert's office and pick up an address book along with some relevant textbooks. What would Herbert say about Professor that, huh? Professor Taylor at the Faculty of History was very helpful, and I managed to approach the subject of the orbs. Don't worry, the he's a massive pervert. Aspect you know what I'm talking about. They had left cancel Family culture. Guy. Hashtag Cancel the Family Guy. The orbs may, in fact, have inspired the Globus Cruciger, which so many royal regalia holds to this day. In ancient times, the orbs were held by priests as a symbol of the sun and its power. As I was leaving, I overheard a disturbing conversation. Sir William Smith, the geologist, was killed last night. What? Less than a fortnight had passed since I'd asked for his expertise. Didn't we hear about I'm William silly, Smith earlier in the game? Feeling responsible somehow. If that's what you want to think. But William Smith, I only heard him once and then that was it. He croaked. Oh no. Oh no. Two. It must be some kind of pattern. Well, I know that. Three. Four. Five. 
I hate this. I hate patterns. I hate it. You know what we're gonna do in the next episode? Cause that, you know what it's all gonna be, right? You know what it's just gonna be. It's gonna be nothing but doing this over and over. Hey, it's some kind of alien guy with arms for pe for pegs for arms. <laughs> Hello, how you doing? Uh, I'm just. I don't know why I have pegs for arms. How are you doing? This is the, probably the best joke I ever did. Bye bye.